Okay, now that you saw the first two layers, it's time to do the yellow cross. Now what you've got to do is get it so that a yellow edge piece that needs to be flipped is on the front face. Then do this algorithm. Do front, right, up. Right inverted, up inverted, front inverted. And what that does is it brings those two up. Now what you've got to do is find another edge piece that has a yellow that needs to be flipped. There's This one needs to be flipped. So put it on the front side, which is it is right now, and do this algorithm do the same thing do front right up right inverted up inverted front inverted and now it's like this diagonal bar so put um, place it so that the yellow the yellow edge piece that's um, not placed properly on the front side and do the same algorithm front right up right inverted up inverted front inverted and now it should be a cross shape and if it's not you did it wrong and just go back and watch exactly what I did because it should take no more than three um, three times of doing the algorithm now what we're gonna do is now that we got all the yellow edge pieces on top we're gonna place it so that um, the sides match so there's blue blue red red green green and orange orange so we need to flip these two and if if when you do it it looks like something like this where like maybe only one of them one of the edges is placed just start turning the cube until you find two stickers that are properly placed and what you do is you put the ones that are properly placed on the right and back side and if it's a case where just a minute I'll try and get there okay if it's a case where it's like this and the orange like the two opposite colors match and pair up you do the same thing except you have to do it more than once so let's start off with this position you find the red and red put it to the right and do this algorithm do right up right inverted up, right, up twice, right inverted. And now match up the colors. So here's green and green, orange and orange. Um, these two colors need to be flipped. So the colors that match, the edge colors that match are the green and the orange. So put it to the right and back side. And then do this algorithm. Do right, up, right inverted, up, right, up twice, right inverted, and then pair them up, red, red, green, green, orange, orange, blue, blue, and there's the, still the cross. Now that you solved the cross, you solved every single edge piece. Now all we have to do is finish solving the corner pieces. Now what you do now is you look around the cube for a yellow corner piece that is in its proper spot so this is in its proper spot yellow orange and green and even if it's like this this is in its proper place because it's in between the same colors so there's yellow orange and green yellow orange and green and also it could be a different color it doesn't have to be yellow orange and green 
if you're looking around and it happens to be yellow, red, and blue, yellow, red, and blue. Now, looking on the top layer, put the corner piece that's in the proper spot on the bottom right. Not turning these, messing up the edges, just rotating the cube around. So put it on the bottom right, and then do this algorithm. Up, away. Up inverted, away. Up, toward, up inverted, toward. And that, what that does is it switches these three corners. And now you look around, it didn't really do anything, so I'm going to do it one more time. Up, away, up inverted, away, up, toward, up inverted, toward. And now all the corners are in its proper spot. And you've got to make sure when you're doing the algorithm that you, first off, you do the up and then you do the right, up inverted, left, up right, up inverted, left, and yeah. Okay, now that you have all these corners that need to be flipped, you just, first off you get one that needs to be flipped on the bottom right section, if you're looking at the yellow face, and then do this algorithm. Do right inverted, down inverted, right, down. And keep doing that until it's flipped properly. Right inverted, down inverted, right, down. So now it's placed properly. And you may look and you're like, I'm messing up the entire thing. Just do not rotate the cube at all leave it in the same position. Now turn, rotate the top layer so that another corner that needs to be flipped is on the bottom right. And do the same algorithm. Right inverted, down inverted, right, down. Keep doing it until the yellow corner is on the top. Right inverted, down inverted, right, down. Right inverted, down inverted, right, down. Right inverted, down inverted, right, down. Um, I finished one cycle. So now turn it, turn the top layer so that the corner that needs to be flipped is in the bottom right and continue the algorithm. Right inverted, down inverted, right, down. 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 That places that on top. Rotate the top layer. And this is the last corner piece that needs to be flipped. Right inverted, down inverted, right, down. Right inverted, down inverted, right, down. And it's solved. And if you did what I was showing you and it's still screwed up, you did something wrong and what you've got to do is go back to this video and look really closely at what I'm doing. Just please look really closely at what I'm doing and copy it likewise. Don't exactly copy it because you will most likely have a different scramble than me. But it's the same concept and the same algorithms. So now that you solved the Rubik's Cube, congratulations, you solved it.